uh, today's debate and the uh, resolution? Well, I think it's very important to uh, have a debate on this uh, tr very tragic issue um, because um, people have been um, uh, driven away from their uh, homeland, more than 100,000 Karabakh Armenians from Artsakh. And uh, it is not only a tragedy, it is a crime that has uh, taken place. And I think uh, furthermore to this debate, these, this issue has to be taken to a higher level, to an international level, so that um, we, the European Union and other stakeholders, ha can decide uh, on further measures. Uh, because it would be very bad if uh, um, things like this or activities like this would be wouldn't be uh, punished. Yes. Um, otherwise, it is the strongest will survive, and all the others will uh, be suppressed. And that's why we have to uh, take it to a high level and debate uh, about sanctions against Azerbaijan. So, do you, do you believe that today's resolution uh, will make it uh, effective for the Council and the European Commission well, to sanction uh, the resolution? Well, to be honest, it's words. It's words. What you need is hard power as well and the political will to uh, take these things through uh, through the European institutions. But at least it's a start, and uh, we have to pursue this issue as well. That's most important. And what do you think uh, the, uh, the, the situation of the refugees in Karabakh is very miserable at the moment in Armenia? What can be done uh, to protect these refugees? I think what is important now that the European Union steps up its medical aid, its humanitarian support, and. Um, and uh, delivers to the, uh, to the to the Armenian government, and in order to uh, help the Karabakh Armenians from Artsakh that are stranded in Goris and other Armenian cities. But now we need to uh, step up our humanitarian aid. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. And you are I'm sorry because I just started to working for the European Parliament also, and uh, you represent. Uh, okay. Okay. So. Uh,